It was a few weeks later when a mysterious stranger showed up at my door and changed my life forever. Well, good afternoon, sir. Gentlemen of the house, I take it? Well, congratulations. Today is your lucky day. How would you like to be the envy of all of your friends and the most popular fellow in town? Well, everything you need to make that happen is right here in this box. Um, my dad's actually... And? Voila. Have you ever seen such a gorgeous instrument? Better yet, try it on. When you play the accordion, you are a one-man band. You are the life of every party. Go ahead, son. Take a little of that, A natural talent. Son, you cannot squander that. You have got to buy this beauty, and I can guarantee you that you're going to have girls lined up around the corner. You're going to need a lifeguard because you're going to be drowning in so much poop. Hey! What's going on here? And hello to you, sir. What are you doing in my house? And why is my innocent young child wearing that devil's squeeze box? That's actually our newest- I thought I told you to shut up! I don't remember you telling me to shut up before, but if you're telling me now, I will gladly. Come here! You made me do this, boy. You brought this evil into the house. Now look at you. Look at you! Take that devilish monstrosity off this very instant! I don't want to see you wearing it ever again! Nick, stop. I think you need to take a walk and cool down. Yeah? I could use some fresh air. Because it stinks in here! I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. I'll, I'll be right here. <coughs> Mister, I'm so sorry about this. My husband, he's a good man and he means well. He just has a little bit of a temper. That's fine. But anyway, if you're amenable to it, I'd like to buy that accordion. Mom, you mean it? How do you feel about an early Christmas present? Yes! thing ever. Thank you so much. There's just one thing. No one can ever see you playing this, especially not your father. Do you understand me? Mom, does dad hate me? No, of course not, sweetie. Then why are you always so hard on me? You're too young to understand this now, but your father has his reasons. I think I have a collapsed lung. Sir, we're trying to have a conversation here.